You should be. Don't, please don't clap. <laughs> Did I say you could clap? <coughs> okay, so let's just get started and welcome out our contestants. Please welcome onto the stage Denise Crosby. I got it. Well, hope you enjoy yourself. Should I sit here? I don't care, you can sit on the floor for all I care. <laughs> I know, but you know, there's other guests here. David Rick! Uh, oh. Hello, I'm David Rick. Hello, I'm David Rick. Oh, brother. Yeah! Someone's had too much sugar. <laughs> Alexis Cruz! <laughs> and of course, Mr. Dean Hagler! Thank you very much. Thank you. Check, what do you need? Check, here it is. Check, check. I'm on, I'm off. Check, I'm not fully on. Check, check, check. Check, check, check. That's not slobber. I had your mic before you did. Anything? <laughs> <laughs> Chad, hi. 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 We're going hi. there, are we? What's that? What's that? That's a button that you should hit more of. That one. You're my inspiration to use. Check, check. Hi. Dirty okay. jokes. <laughs> one word. Two button chips. <laughs> <laughs> I went, what's going on? I missed that. What's that? It was just for me to know. <laughs> so we just get started? I, I guess. Yeah, we're ready for the first game. I'm going to be yelling. You can yell. Okay. Okay, right. Yeah. First game, multiple personalities. This game is for Denise, David, and Alexis. Okay, we're going to have some props in just a second. A personality attached to each prop. Actors do a scene using the personality attached to the prop. Must change personality when props are exchanged. One prop per player see props. <laughs> Roger! Yes. Okay. I thought all that. Okay. Did you not understand a word of that? I no. think it meant fake it. I didn't understand. Fake it. <laughs> oh, they come in bags. That's okay. Cool. Hey, One prop per person. <laughs> now, now you can change your props. Oh. <laughs> Newlyweds run into wife's old boyfriend who doesn't know the woman is now married. Wait, is that enough? Can we, can we, can we, can we just start doing I guess something? so. I just, I just have to tell the week the cards. Well, you want read it again? Can we, newlyweds run into wife's old boyfriend who doesn't know the woman is now married. Oh, okay, so do okay, so explain. So you're the old boyfriend, you're two are married, and I'm the old boyfriend. <laughs> So personalities. Oh, now we need personalities. Are they personalities? I know I'm not, obviously. They're all our props. I take it. They're all the props. Oh, there you are, look at that. Okay. Personality stage. Oh, there we are. Personality of Golem? This works much better. This 
We use only the lines on the car. Oh, he's my. Nice to meet you. Can I see your tan lines? <laughs> I'm not gay, but I'll learn. <laughs> Can I please be your slave tonight? Show me the money. <laughs> but can I see your tan lines? Hmm. Show me the money. <laughs> can I see your tan lines? Hey, I'm not gay, but I'll learn. <laughs> <clears throat> can I please uh, be your slave tonight? <laughs> well, I'm not gay, <laughs> but... Mm. I'll learn. <laughs> Can I see your tan lights? Show me the money. <laughs> Can I please be your slave tonight? Mm. Show me the money. Can I please be your slave tonight? I'm not gay, but I'll learn. Can I please be your slave tonight? I'm not gay. <laughs> I think someone's done that before. Damn the internet! Okay, gate number three. This one's for all of you. This is called Superheroes. Okay, so first, what I need is I need the audience to give me uh, just a superhero that Dean will be played. So yell out a superhero. Dark Ball! Dark Ball! Dark Ball! Let's go with Aquaman, shall we? Aquaman! 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 Okay, now we need a, uh, a crisis that Dean will need to solve, so let's have a crisis, anyone. Dinner's late! Dinner's late! Dinner's late! Dinner's late! Dinner's late! I like that one. Okay, now the rest of you, you're going to enter one at a time as different superheroes, but each superhero will be chosen by Dean, so Dean will choose the type of serial superhero that you are. Oh, really? So yeah. Do I'm not getting them from the audience? No, 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 no. You pick the rest of them. Uh, and then you will adopt and maintain your roles and attempt to solve the crisis that we have just chosen. So, dinner's late. Dinner's <laughs> <laughs> <It was> late. <laughs> oh, wow. Fire went ready. Okay. All right. Urinal 
cake to make it a whole bit better, I'm sorry. Superman. I'm tired of your sexist jokes. Oh, you see my penis up from between your braces. It hurts. Yes. Wow, what a joke. This has gone horribly awry. I'm totally sorry about you having to cook. How can I make it up to you? You. I'm really worried now. Can I just have a drink from sure. you, Aquaman? Yeah, of course. Let me. Let me summon the dolphin. That's gross, Robin. Yeah. Sorry, I only have a dolphin decanter for the alcohol. If you expect me to urinate again, you're gonna have to do that to me, Aquaman. Why wonder? You're wondering. <laughs> Is it the sight of my perfect 46 inch breast and 20 inch waist has <laughs> gotten you? Oh, you know I'm not interested in your breasts. <laughs> Are you Wonder Woman or Spider-Man? I can't remember. I... So where's dinner? How are you? Where's dinner? Well, we hate the urinal Wonder cakes I... for appetizers. Where's the meatloaf? Time for dessert. Oh, yeah, the, yes. the meatloaf. Please, please. Because I've been sitting in a pool of urine for some time now. <laughs> what are you making, Wonder Woman? With your breasts. I am... I'm floating them on my 48-inch breasts. My God! So, you're going to improvise a soap opera style scene as animals that I'm about to designate. So, ones I just randomly picked up here. David, you can be a, a bear, I guess. And uh, uh, Alexis, an octopus. If I'm not, it's a pretty good disguise, right, sir? <laughs> By the way. Uh, and what, what are you? An octopus. <laughs> of course. <laughs> soap opera scene. Okay. <laughs> hey, what's going on around here? Is that a picnic basket you got in your shorts or you're just happy to see me? I'm very happy to see you! My God. How can you be grabbing me around the waist well, while your other hands are flying through the air? Because I won't let you go! I won't oh. let you go no matter what they say! It's never like this! So, uh... It might be your baby, but you're my bear! But I understand you've been dating my friend Boo Boo! Well, yes, but, you know, he, he, 
He seduced me. <laughs> but he seduced me in the barricade. How could he seduce you at the same time? Damn you, you're a liar. Uh, you with all of your hands and tentacles, yes, grabbing everything. Yes, I am very handy that way. Yes. <laughs> There's only one picnic basket good enough for the both of us. And it's mine. Boo-boo, picnic basket is mine. Okay. But not before I splash you with my inky blackness. Damn you! <laughs> oh, I can't say picnic baskets! Mr. Ranger! And now, Boo Boo, now's our chance! Let's run away together! Don't do it, Boo Boo! You're mine! Mr. Ranger! <laughs> okay, let's move then on to game number five. This is once again for all four of you, but we're going to have two teams. So Denise and Dean and David and Alexis. Get out of your way. Okay, each team will receive a prop. Players must come up with quick scenes alternating. That involved the props given. Yes. Yep, yeah, okay. Very good. Take the white and the red sticks. That's it. Yep. Yeah. And... Uh, <laughs> okay. Okay. Wait. Okay. We share it. I can't get a dance, 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 get a This is the proper behavior that we want. Bound submissive behavior. Just <laughs> like this. Give it a nice long bump and then very quiet. Yes, just like that. You have to exercise discipline and yes. then affection. <laughs> Hey, Denise, wild party! Thanks, <laughs> Dad. Yeah, I got it from uh, I got it online at this, you know, Trekkie convention. <laughs> they really, you know, they get the best stuff. Uh, yes. Uh, 
And this is the 90-second alphabet. 90 seconds? No, no, yeah, well... I don't know my alphabet. In 90 seconds. <laughs> it's a different alphabet. Okay, in this scene, each word must begin with the next letter of the alphabet. The audience provides a starting letter, and the goal is to use every alphabet letter to make consistent words and sentences. So first... Q! No, Q! We'll go with Q. That was the first one. Q. Q. Okay, let's see. Each word or is it each sentence? Each word. Word. Each word must begin with the next letter of the alphabet. It just goes one after the other. Or we just do a scene where we're saying one word at a time. It doesn't specifically say. Very good. There you are. So, the scene is a mysterious object is found in, I guess that says punch bowl, at a wedding. <laughs> at a wedding. Okay. Queer. <laughs> really? Super. <laughs> Tasteless. <laughs> Unequivocal. <laughs> Very. Um. Wet. <laughs> Xenophobic? <laughs> you? <laughs> you? <laughs> Zebra head! <laughs> Asshole! Suggested by the audience, players must use okay. items provided in bag. They are there are six. Oh, here we are. Okay. There's your bag. And we have to use these. All right. Okay, and let's have a personal problem. that is going to fix that itching, burning sensation. You've never seen anything like it, I guarantee. You've tried, you've probably tried all the over-counter preparations many times. My personal favorite has always been Tux. Now, Tux are good on occasion, but you can't always be carrying Tux around. That's why, if you have the new car radiator, <laughs> 
an air filter. This is called the new butt filter. <laughs> and please, show them how the butt filter works. <laughs> since, um, you know, generally speaking, my butt isn't this size. But once in a while, especially after the holidays, it is. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you. Wow. I take the new, and believe me, this is 100% money back guarantee, folks. If you're not happy with it, we will send your money back. It's the least that we can do, and you will still have the burning and itching irritation. Now, what I usually do is I like to take butt filter, and I usually like to um, take a nice quiet place, you know, obviously you don't want to do this with everyone around, so what I like to do is I like to find a nice quiet place, and I set it down. Then, I take my butt, and I like to put it on the butt filter. <laughs> when I'm cooking dinner. <laughs> and I just like to sit down, you know, I just sit down and, you know, instead of standing there watching the pot boil, I could be sitting on my butt filter. <laughs> just to be careful not to confuse the uh, throwaway pan for your salad bowl. <laughs> Surely such a butt thing must be expensive. Oh, good question. Thank you for bringing that up. We include, for $19.99, we include your personal frame, your, we give you four removable HEPA filter butt filters. <laughs> the drip bowl. The catching pan. The catching pan. And for those hard to reach areas. <laughs> now, this is not going to be every day we're offering this kind of price. I mean, for $19.99, if you don't call now, this usually retails for $173 at, at you know, your Walmart and everywhere else. So it's a drop in the toilet. It's, <laughs> And the screen will be, the, the, the number is, is present on the screen right now. If you call 1-800-WIPEBUT, W-I-P-E-B-U-T, 1-800, you will receive, and you know what? We're going to throw something special. If in. you act now, you'll get this little stand that will just set up your butt filter for you. You don't even need to sit down. It just stands there. This is the base. And then you put it on there because it functions as double duty. Dude. Right, you need someone to hold everything. Whoa, you would now. ship me, would you? And back now, in the next 10 minutes, and you will get this fantastic wig so that your friends will never know that you're even using this product. And not only Holy crap. does this work as a wig, which we can tell, is so lovely. Once removed for those moist spots, <laughs> it just cleans right up. And it's made of 100% cotton, so there will be no irritation. No rashes, no irritation. Much it's better than shark. Completely, um, you know, allergy free <laughs> and approved by the. Uh, uh, Derma, uh, the, the American Derma, Dermatological Society. <laughs> but call now, call now, 1-800-WIPE-BUT. That's Only right. Only within the next right. 10 minutes, no matter how many times you see this commercial. Now, so we're going to play our very final game. This one's for all four of you. Wow, very nice. 
I just saw something. You can, you can keep the hemorrhoid stuff. We don't, we don't want that back. Okay, so for all four of you, our final game. Oh! Yeah. This is called the Irish Drinking Song. Okay, so you've got to sing an Irish drinking song, one line by each performer at a time. And the subject of the song is being a sci-fi fan. <laughs> Whatever you're I'll be the leprechaun. Right. <laughs> uh, okay, here we go. Uh, what's the, uh, yeah. In the top of the morning, I licked around. And I looked at my television, <laughs> and there I saw a, a convention in town. And even though I couldn't go, I did TiVo it. TiVo it, And sometimes I use something else to tape my shows. <laughs> and then I realized I get it on the DVD. <laughs> it is my favorite show. I love it very much. <laughs> Especially like the blonde on the next generation. <laughs> and I put my head in the boots of the girl of the blonde from the next generation. <laughs> and I feel like I'm for the ball with the girl from the next generation. <laughs> and then one day, when my pot of gold is gone, I'll be able to get a job on that show with the girl with the next generation. <laughs> Because we're Irish, <laughs> and we like to take the TV in our hands. <laughs> 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 we like to take the TV in our hands when we're holding our breasts from the one girl from the next generation. <laughs> and then we take the TV and we throw it through the bar. We get to do a fight and we drink it really hard. It's out of this world. <laughs> Jonathan Flakes here in...